is boxing permitted is mixed martial arts mma permitted can we take part in the sports in this competition as far as boxing is concerned before i give the opinion of the muslim scholars as far as boxing is concerned there are many non muslims who are against this sport and they say this is not a sport at all because it harms the human being there are many non muslim organizations which have objected and have asked that this boxing should be removed from the international sports it is not a sport at all as far as islam is concerned any sport which is beneficial for the human being which helps the human being and has got no harm it should be done but if the sport is not beneficial and is harmful for the human body then you should abstain from it so these non muslim organizations they have filed petitions in many countries unfortunately most of the countries have disagreed except sweden sweden is the only country which has agreed to ban boxing as a sport if you read the huna magazine which published from london they say in the magazine that from 1945 to 1983 in a span of 38 years 350 boxers have died because of injuries during the boxing match and there are tens of thousands who have been injured so based on this they want to ban this sport because it is harmful for the human being as far as the islamic ruling is concerned we know that our beloved prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said that when two of the sahabas were wrestling he said that do not hit on the face the prophet prohibited from hitting on the face we also know that when the lady who was given the punishment of stoning to death because of adultery the prophet said do not stone her face imagine when there is a hath penalty given when a person is adultery and this punishment given even at that time the prophet said that do not hit at the face so in islam hitting at the face or injuring the face is not permitted so based on this if you compare and see in boxing in boxing you get points especially when there's a boxing match and you get more points if you hit at the face the maximum point that you get is hitting at the face and the best match you can win is with a knockout punch that means the more you harm the opponent the more points you get this is against the concept of islam based on this according to imam an nawawi he says that this sport it should not be permitted it's not islamic because you're harming the body hitting on the face based on that this sport is not permitted so based on this hadith of not to harm the face not to harm the human body most of the scholars they say that boxing and any type of martial art which causes injury to the human being in which it involves hitting of the face and injury of the human being it is not permitted however there are some scholars who say that if you are learning boxing or some martial arts for self defense without involving in competition because in competition you have to attack your opponent you have to hit him you have to beat him otherwise you cannot win so they say that if you train yourself in boxing or martial arts only for self defense or only for health reason or also being prepared for jihad etc but it doesn't involve in competition where you have to hit the other person in this cases it is permitted this is said only by some scholars but the majority scholars say involving in boxing as well as martial arts where there is injury to the human body and attacking the other person